Yeah, this is a eight horse Globe Ironworks engine built in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Also known as a white gasoline engine. It's got kind of a unique latch out for the uh, hit and miss mechanism and I just thought I'd film a video showing this how it operates. The cam gear here drives uh, the governor. The governor's still laying down in the crankcase there. I haven't got it installed yet. There's a lot of stuff messed up on this engine. We've been working on fitting it all back together and tightening things up and getting it all set so it operates smoothly. And the governor will eventually operate down on that lever there that uh, doesn't move much but all it's got to do is press that up and down and it'll uh, it'll latch out and, and coast. Cam on the back side there's for the igniter trip. But, uh, I'm going to set the camera down because it's kind of hard to operate this while uh, with one hand but uh, you can see the lever moving back and forth there that uh, operates the exhaust valve on the other side of the engine I'll show you that in a minute but uh, when the governor lifts up it unlatches right there and drops the uh, the crank drops the lever that uh, and uh, in this position the exhaust valve would be held open and the intake valve held shut the fuel pumps still running but uh, it's just coasting and when the governor kicks back in there it'll come back on the next cycle grab operate shut the allow the exhaust valve to shut taking in a charge the engine will fire come back the governor should pick up after one hit it'll drop it and there it goes again coasting kind of a unique action that shaft there goes all the way around to the other side of the engine right here that ramp works on that roller I'll show you how it starts and stops there it's left holding the valve open pick up again this screw here is for a decompression device when it comes up there it'll bump the bump the roller let a little bit of compression out for starting. And that eyelet there will eventually connect to the exhaust valve which mounts in that cage right there on the side. So. That gives you just a little bit of a overview because I've seen some of these engines uh, on videos before and I wasn't sure all what was going on until I got closer to study one. It's quite a quite a unique mechanism. See there's the there's the latch out right there. Just like that. Hopefully that explains it a, a little better. Uh, 
thanks for watching.